No, no. Oh, no. <laughs> oh, no. The last thing I want at the moment is to face Seaman. But there you go. <laughs> Two, 270 TV advantage is all right, isn't it? The claw's useless. Oh, no, he's got, he's got oafs. He's got 13. He's got 13 men. He's got guard. He's got a dirty player. He's got a claw mighty blow. He's one, two, lost one. He's got a wizard. I thought I did think I did think I was right. Obviously, that's why I thought it. <laughs> but that's what I figured. I mean, it would be outrageous if it was up to three hundred. And like when when you think when you think the bushwhacker does five, it only made sense the thirty. I mean, you couldn't be it couldn't do a hundred basic, could it? It just couldn't. It just couldn't. <laughs> but it's still ridiculous. It's ridiculous compared to bushwhacker, isn't it? Shit's all over Bushwhacker. Bushwhacker's just pointless, I guess, now. Completely outclassed by the... But he didn't get a wizard. Oh, he got a bribe, though. Oh, man. Massive underdog. Oh, I, I always feel like I'm the underdog against Norse, because they're always just orcs with block whenever I play them. <laughs> they're all just... They're all just going to be movement six with block. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Movement six orcs with block. They're just better than orcs. Or humans with plus one a plus two AV and block. That's what they are for the same cause. They're disgusting. They never arm a seven. Hopefully in Aryan. Yep, I've got a bit of bloat with the claws. Well, it's not worthless though, because I still get to hit the oafs and the big guy. So, what the fuck? I tried to receive. Oh shit! Shit! I tried to receive. <gasps> fuck! Because he didn't have the wizard. I, like even said in my head, I'll I'll receive because he hasn't got the wizard. Oh fuck! Oh no, I'm gonna lose now because I didn't re didn't didn't receive. Shit. Pretty sad about that. Yeah, but you never use any of them though, that's the thing, leading hippie. None of them get used, do they? Like who is it like Sal? And Sal's the only one basically that can that can buff Bushwhacker. Yeah, I wanted to receive it. I I I don't know, I must have misclicked or it was a fuck. But yeah, I'd receive and just crush him because he didn't have a wizard. If you'd had a wizard I would have kicked. But um yeah, I just fucked up. Just fucking must have misclicked. Shit. Yeah, I blame Fash too. It's always his fault. Like who does who does buff bushwhacker? Jim. You're never using Jim, are you? Once you've got um and it's only twenty percent as well. So even if you added all of them, they ain't fucking coming close to it. But um Yeah, Jim, you're never using Jim because you've got Veronica. Um Even if Emo Werewolf does, you've got Terps. If Sasha does, you've got Mindy. If the Hermit does, you'd never use him. Yeah, the Hermit does. Um, so Sal's basically the only one that ever would ever get used that buffs it. Maybe Kuri does. I don't know. He's on a mission. I can't see. Maybe Kuri would boost it. But realistically... And even then, even with all of them boosting it, it's only 20% each time. And it's only 15% base. So 15 with like loads of 20%, they ain't getting close to 90. It's, it, there's no way it's fucking close. No fucking way. 
the the new the new clicker has got to blow blow the bushwhacker out the water completely, completely not even close. I don't think anyway. I don't think even vaguely close. And he's got a DPS with all buff as well, which is ridiculous. Well, she it's technically. Technically a girl alien, ah, but you using I get using being roll, but you, the princess um, princess isn't using optimal DPS, but um, you know yeah you, you I guess for us the princess is gonna be better than being roll for DPS, but. and yeah and Sal you're not gonna use Sal anyway I don't know why I mentioned Sal like he was anything that anybody would ever use. So yeah, Princess is made way more usable than Sal. The click is just amazing. It almost makes um, Kizzle Blip usable, is how good it is, isn't it? Because Kizzle Blip's got two skills that boost itself. At, um, like it almost makes Kizzle Blip usable over, over Ilsa. It might, be, it might make Kizzle Blip better than Ilsa, you know? I think I think the new clicker might actually make Kizzlebit better than Ilsa. Because Ilsa only gets one to boost herself. And maybe one from Mercy. Whereas Kizzleblip's got two to boost herself, plus one from Billy if you're using Billy. And then um the clicker's got one to boost Kizzleblip as well. I guess for us. But then there's Ro Robo Rudolph, isn't there? He might be better overall. Or, or the external, or probably Robo Rudolph. I don't know. There you go. Use your claw on the uh, armor seven guy. Nice play. Two thousand two hundred TV kills, team. Holy shit. Yeah, indeed, Kiz is also magic. Yeah, so, so I reckon for us, Kiz might just be better than Ilsa. Really, really think Kiz might be better for us. It just depends how many how many legendaries you've got, doesn't it? That's the thing. That is that is the thing. Is just is just how many legendaries you've got. Because Ilsa is a bad DPS, really. Um, it's just that she's in the twenty second slot instead of the. 20th or 21st or whatever. It's just going to depend on how they're geared up, doesn't it? I imagine my Kizzle Blip is going to be quite well geared up as, I, as I'll fail to get the, the gear for Billy. <laughs> Unlike Jam Toast. I'll just, I'll just buy 100 chests and, and never do it. Yeah, yeah, that's true. That's very true, John Toast, yeah. Very true. It's all about the legendaries, though, isn't it? That's, that's the key thing. It'll be interesting. It'll, it's worth asking Tasselfoot, isn't it, whether 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 that clicker will make Kizzleblip good, because essentially you've got to use that clicker. That clicker's got to be better than um, got to be better than Robo Rabbit, hasn't it? And Bushwhacker. Sorry, man, kids, but there's nothing to talk about. It's his turn. VGP here, as you can see, he made some blocks. He moved some men, and it took him two and a half minutes. To make three blocks and move some men. 
it was a super exciting turn. There's not a lot to say. Right, now it's my turn. I can get back to Blood Bowl. I always zone out in my opponent's turns. Maybe it's a weakness that I shouldn't do. Could get a guard in there, one dice him. Doesn't seem great, does it? Can claw him. Might as well. I like hitting people who don't have block for a Norse team. <laughs> Face him up with a guard. Frenzy trap, if possible. I guess I have to um, ignore him. Funny that I take like 10 seconds to do that. Yeah, I'm sad that Natalie is semi retired. Every time I'm doing a mission and I see Natalie there, I'm like, ah. Oh. <laughs> no, I'm keeping it legendary for, you know, the end of the run. Gold find switch. Although I might not need her, I guess. I might not even need to switch her in. Because it's not anywhere near as big a deal now, is it? Now that it's not multiplicative anymore. It's a pretty big deal. It's like 20 times as much gold find. Yeah, I guess if I disenchanted it, I could make another legendary good. Make Natalie great again. Frenzy trap for you. I guess he's gonna blitz this bull, isn't he? He's fucking yet. But it's into a one. No, I can push him there. Fair enough, shit. No, he can't. Oh, yeah, he can't even blitz him there. I was thinking that blitz down, but he's giving up a block back. I fucking hate Nors. Just fucking hate them. Uh, this is, I know this is going to be a Kaz. Oh, and he can even push him away, so he doesn't. he's not based. That's good, isn't it? No, he doesn't do it. Dumbass play. Dumbass play there. I mean, that's really tremendously bad play from him, isn't it? He had the opportunity to push him, and then he wouldn't have been blocked back. But instead, he just chose to give up an easy 2D. Wow. Wow, it was terrible, terrible play. Oh, but he's going to get lucky on the foul, I bet. Oh, man. Oh, man, no, don't you think about getting lucky on this foul. Good. I 
think this guy can stand up and put a little bit of pressure on the ball now. When I say a little bit, I fucking mean a little bit. Oh, that was a bad push. Very bad push. Should have pushed to here. Now he's still in contact if I don't pal him. Terrible play. Got lucky. But that was his terrible play punish. So good. Good for you. I think this is enough of a massive guys around there to you know, can maybe go back. Maybe push forward with a race. Who knows? <laughs> I'm sorry, I'll try to focus on the blood ball, but you know, I do like Crusaders Lost Idols and it's a pretty, pretty huge, huge update if they've made somebody who was format defining completely overshadowed by somebody else. It's pretty crazy, isn't it? Don't know if I'm gonna cap without without Natalie. I'm at level six hundred and I'm already uh, not insta killing. <laughs> Maybe I need to um, get some more legendaries. Oh. Legendary levels. I'll focus a little bit more on deeps. No cunt. Yeah, KO for no reason, yeah. Yeah, but um yeah, I messed it up. I misplayed as well as I was as I was slating him for his misplay, I also misplayed just quietly. Oh shit he got the No, it's only a one dice. I really, really didn't want him to be able to two dice that hobgoblin. I guess he's gonna one D because he's got block and I haven't. I'm a Kaz because I'm a seven.
Should take the fucking block first, shouldn't I? He could go there, then he could block, then he could go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, double GF fight, 2D after a dodge. Or he could just 1D. Three. He could go there and base him. He could block. No, no, he can't because he needs the assist to block. So he's got to stand up, whatever happens. He could just 1D, but then the, the both down's not good enough. So I reckon dodge out and get there. Because I have to get the push. To go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, G, 4. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, five. Got to re-roll this one, haven't I? Don't even do it. Unbelievable. All right. Blots. The things I've still got dodge. I think it's better to make a dodge there in one GFI. Otherwise, I'd have made. Double GFIs if I'd used dodge in the first one. Get fucked, you piece of shit. Guess I've got to base him, haven't I? Base the ball. Doesn't have berserkers, no. BTB. <laughs> oh man, one D. That's all he needed as well, wasn't it? Can he score? One, two, no, oh, fuck. One, two, three, four, five, six, double GFI, he can score. But I mean, if he does, he probably loses anyway, doesn't he? So, that's good. Just loop back in it. Yeah. Fuck. Oh, I can't believe it cost me cost me the fucking strength four hog to to do. Oh good, good. That's very nice. That's very nice, isn't it? The fucking snow trolls staying out. Yeti, whatever you want to call it. He doesn't have berserkers. He's got, um, yeah, he's got oaths. Snow cunt, yeah. <laughs> Snow cunt's a pretty official name. Should make a team called Snow cunt. No. 
Force Bear Blitzers. <laughs> Fuck knows. Fuck knows. Mighty Ulf Werners, probably, because the models are so small and Blood Bowl, too. It's so bad, isn't it? Chaos Chosen and Beastmen Runners and stuff. What the fuck? I can't even. I can't even believe how bad it is. Holy shit, the new names. Fucking Piranha Warrior Catchers. Fuck is it? I just. It's just mind boggling, isn't it? Necromantic horrors, yeah. Fucking. Oh, I don't have sure hands anymore. Shit. Not only was it losing the um, strength four, it's also losing sure hands. I mean, the sure hands is essential for quick scores, I think. Not essential, but invaluable. Um, so. There is that. Getting the claw hits. I don't know why, just so I can skill them up, I guess. Yeah, shambling on death. Go for the catch, eh? speed did it break oh well thank you for the follow as a door same that, shame that the alert box is broken as per fucking usual it's always broken that you get to go here to shore over there Follow so that the bull gets three dice. Then one, two, three, four square hitting him. I think more important just to get the ball now, isn't it? Yeah. Wasted that reroll on the double skulls. Fuck. Turn five. Don't have to pick it up, turn five. You believe it's flat earth theory, oh dear. To be fair, I've got I've got somebody on my Facebook who supports the Tories, so you know, that's about as fucking nonsensical as the flat earth society, isn't it? No, you but um
No, it doesn't happen that often, but the thing is, you've got no mighty blow deal with the starting teams. So it's it's a lot more likely to happen with starting teams than anything else. No, he's one of these guys. Another one of these Norse players who's like, I'm going to give you as many two dice blocks as I can. And you'll roll some double skulls. And not. That's literally the extent of his game plan. And the sad thing is, it'll probably work. I need a player in here, don't I? Which, um. Or GFI. Whoa, why is that one? Oh, because I clicked on the wrong guy. Can't really stand him up to get surfed, can I? But then if I don't stand him up, he just goes and blitzes him and gets the ball, so I guess I've got to stand him up. And I guess he has to block. That would have been a failed pickup. Two ones on the pickup so far. Can't even fucking dodge away from this wolf now. Fucking, I'll do the same as him then, eh? Hope you don't knock my guys over. Sounds smart. <laughs> yeah, exactly. He's on the cover. Oh, man. This is, this is what Ducky uses against the wizard, isn't it? Funny enough. Though I just did it because it was the only shape I could make. It still worked. Like, it's just sad that this is all he's taken, isn't it? Oh, good. Mm. That was really shit that, that was my safe moves first was getting the guy served. Fucking horrible, isn't it? I really, I really can't put into words how much I hate Norse. <laughs> it's just nonsense, isn't it? <laughs> At least Amazons are, are like an Armour 7 bash team that has dodge. So like, you know, they're, they're doing something... They're not just a straight up bash team. <laughs> I give up. I give up with block. Armour broken. <laughs> you know, he gives up six blocks, nothing. I'm like, I'll play his fucking game. 
That's what happened. This is why I never fucking base anybody. But these fuckers are just like, yeah. Yeah, I'll play an armor 17 and base everybody every turn. Every single turn, I'll just base constantly. You'll 2D me, get both down, do nothing. I'll 1D you and get a pow. I just... It's too much, isn't it? It's too much to play against Norse. It's just too much. Arm break. Injury. Fuck off. It's just... How has this happened? His game plan... I just... It's just, what is it? What the fuck is that? Well, how does that even happen? He gives up a two dice block. I get a ball down. He one dices me back. And fucking Kaz is my best player. Jesus, I'm going to find everyone who plays Norse in real life and just beat them to within inch of their fucking life. Like that scene in fucking... Fucking, what's it called? Fight Club, where he just mashes his fucking face into pulp. I'd like to do that to everybody who's ever fucking played Norse, ever, in their fucking lives. Because fuck everybody who plays fucking not like this. Like this. My plan is to give up a two dice block, you roll a one in nine, me roll a one in six, and Kazia. That's how they fucking win. Holy shit. That's what happens when I do. And that, of course, don't forget that. That can happen when I do one nice box as well. This just to get a two dice pop. Fuck it. No, oh, yeah, I could have blocked him that way. But I wanted two, 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 one, two, two, two. I just fail it and die. Right, that's it. I'm out. I'm out for six weeks. Right, I'm sorry if you don't like the sound of the fan. If you can hear the fan. But, um, it's going to be on. fine and don't turn it on because I thought it does it sound bad I thought it would sound bad so I never turned it on um, but need to cool down now oh man fucking nose
holy shit. What even are they? What even are gnomes? Just fuck off. There's just no need. There's just no need for knots in the game. Take them out. Take them fucking out, please. Please remove knots from the game. That's all I can say. and then dodge away <laughs> but then that's one two four five six seven eight nine there still can't be a kind of screen could just base him still don't get 2d you could go one two three four five six seven eight but it just didn't achieve anything so it could go one two it's just horrible, isn't it? I mean, I guess basing the frenzy guy is the best I can do. Lock him. Can you hear? Can you hear the fan? It sounds really loud to me, but um. Oh god, is this? Oh god, I'm, I I don't click on this, but I'm gonna do it. Oh god, yeah, that would be amazing. Holy shit. I thought it was going to be something rude then, with that title. But, um, can't hear it. Alright, excellent. In that case, it'll be on regular. Industrial fans are just Australian house fans. Right, that is, that is fantastic. That means I can have it on all the time. Right, so now the only question is whether to run around. Like this or not. I mean four plus three plus I can I can Google it, can't I? I'd rather not use a reroll. Not Google it, Sambury. So it's dodge four three Two two, no, no, it would be no zero, no two twos. So the dodge would be sixty one without a reroll, and sixty six with. The other way is sixty one without, and eighty two with. So I guess it's definitely better to do it that way. On the other hand, I could get to there. One, two, three, four, five, six, eight, you still get there. Yeah, I'd added I'd added the dodge in. Um I have to stand up to stop him getting three dice, I guess. Ooh, only just in time. Now some people have fans to be fair, some people have seen them fans in uh, in England. But you know, <laughs> they're a bit of a waste because it's only hot for one week every year. <laughs> That's the thing. Ah oh, there you go, power of me bludger. Silly me. Silly me thinking I had a chance. You can't beat. You just can't beat people who, who get their yeti knocked out for no reason and give you a two dice block that you won in nine and they one dice you back and power you and kill you. It's just shit. It's just fucking shit. So maybe that is why the good players aren't that good at blood bowl. Maybe it is the chance makes it that the good players can't be that good, but. I don't think anyone's tried to be that good at Blood Bowl. 
I really don't like, you know, they haven't tried to be good at Blood Bowl like they've tried to be good at, at chess. That's the thing, isn't it? Like, I don't think anybody who plays Blood Bowl is comparable to a, to a Grandmaster, you know? I just think they're comparable to someone who plays Sunday League football. They like it and do it for a bit of a laugh. So, who knows if somebody took it as seriously as like Cristiano Ronaldo takes football. Um, who knows what would happen. Maybe that's what I should do rather than trying to be entertaining. Maybe I should just try to become the world's first good blood ball player. You can reach, can you? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, yeah. So, double GFI for a 1D. He could dodge away to make it a 2D. It's probably not worth it though when it's a 2 plus to, to do the 1D, isn't it? Because it clears the, clears the tackle zone at least. This fan is super loud for me. Ridiculously loud. That worked out pretty glorious in the end, didn't it? <laughs> Come on, stay out. Fuck! Fucking out bash by fucking AV7 bash team! The fuck is it though? Honestly, it just winds me up. It, it actually makes me want to cry. Look how bad they are. Look how bad this shitty fucking team is. An armor 7 bash team. What went through the designer's mind when they made this? What goes through the mind of anyone who wants to fucking use it? does my fucking nothing. It really does do my fucking nothing. No, I, I call them, um, <laughs> I call, you know, Ducky Sunday League Calibre, you know? I really do. Ducky, Pete W, Endzone, Purple Goo, they're all just Sunday League Calibre, aren't they? They just, they just play it because they like it. Play it on a weekend every now and then. So, um... So, you know, it's, uh... <laughs> ah, yeah, Twitch is knowing some replays a bit shit in there, yeah. That's true. <laughs> I, was, I was the same Oogler. <laughs> I just turned back and I was like, how the fuck have I got a chance? Well, there you go, then. I think it's fair, Ducky. Honestly, I think it's absolutely fair. Um... I think it's absolutely fair. I'm sure people who people who play Sunday League play football every day or train every day, at least to an extent. Or maybe it's not Sunday League, but you know, um, fucking, you know, very low tier. They're not. You're nothing like you're nothing like a pro sportsman, though. Are you? Do you know what I mean? And I don't think anybody is who plays football. All right, fair enough. Then. Fair enough. <laughs> but I really don't think that, you know I, I lumped you in with the best players you know Purple Goo and Pete W and that I think they're all they're all just like you know that's it they're, I think they're all like that I wasn't I wasn't singling you out um, I just don't think anybody when you compare it to chess, which is like, you know, it's chess or, well, poker, I guess. It's more like, it's most like poker, isn't it? Because there's an element of skill and an element of RNG. Nobody practices it. There's no, nobody's anything like Phil Ivy, are they? They're just, um, <laughs> dice warmed, warmed out. <laughs> you know, not, 
There's, I don't think anyone's like Phil Ivy. Nothing like that, or um, or you know, a grandmaster in chess. I don't think any of them. That's the best thing you can do if you for blood ball. By the way, if you're playing tabletop blood ball, rolling d6 so you practice the sixes is actually the best thing you can do. Because the way you roll the dice can absolutely impact what you roll. Which is why in the casino they make you hit the wall. Because people can fucking influence what they roll. So, um, oh, here's his, gra his master plan of hit as many guys as you can. I hope they don't die. And then I get to fucking hit you back and kill yours. Whoa. <sighs> Nothing grinds my gear as much as fucking Norse. Holy shit. Lots of things grind my gears in Blood Bowl, but nothing is as bad as Norse. Just nothing. Nothing. I. Oh. Oh. <laughs> I just. I just don't get it. This is a bit too intense, this fan. I couldn't do it. I can't do it because when I play Norse. I'm like, holy shit, all my guys are armor 7. Better never give up a block, ever, because they're fucking armor 7. This guy, all men's LOS. Every turn, all men's contact, every turn. Here, hit me with your bull centaur. I'll just one dice power him back and kill him. Just give away an instant two dice. <laughs> oh, God. He's break tackled, isn't he, at least? I don't even know what I can do. Like, the, the all mans in here isn't bad, is it? Because I just don't have any players left. Due to his amazing strategy of hoping his guys didn't die. Paid off for him big style.
I'm just going to concede every time I face an horse in the future. Just better for my health. I just can't stand people. I can't stand people who fucking play dwarf Norse. What the fuck is it? At least dwarves are fucking powerful, you know. I said dwarves by mistake. At least dwarves are fucking armor nine and stuff. At least like not. At least uh, uh, Amazons have survivability. Norse have nothing. They're just utter garbage, and they're only played by dickheads. Just a whole plan is to just literally get their armor seven punched in the face as much as possible. Everyone, everyone I've ever played who uses Norse is completely fucking brainless. At least some of them have been in uh, in you no know, res formats. It's understandable in res formats because then getting your armor seven punched all the time is um is pretty fucking not bad, is it? Because at least. I think I'm just gonna come see. Oh well, that's funny. Right. Hey. Yeah, I can play your game too. Hey. <laughs> Aren't oh, I clever? But even then, I'm not playing his game because I did it because there was fuck all else I could do. Yeah, exactly. If I just conceded, I wouldn't have had a dead bull center. Still would have lost. If only I'd received. If I'd received, maybe I would have outbashed him, but it's fucking unlikely, isn't it? Fucking unlikely when they're armor 7. When they're all armor 7 and I'm armor 9, it's pretty unlikely for me to outbash them. Fucking waste of fucking space. Fucking nuts. Two deaths. And thank fuck I didn't apple. That well, no, the apple failed anyway. Go there with him first. And then he. 
dodges and blitzes or just blitzes and then bases. I want a double GFI, don't I? No, the strength four is the only one who hasn't um, hasn't fucking died. One, two. Uh, maybe I should just go in there and base both of these guys. Yeah, probably the best, isn't it? Might as well get people hit. In desperate effort to get a draw out of this. You can minus 2D him and you can dodge away. I guess I had an early start at least, eh? So the deaths aren't such a such a fucking uh, such a setback. Yeah, I still switched to Natalie at the end. I can't do it without her. Four three to score, and then I mean it'll be a two all draw. There's no way I can stop them scoring with no players. No safe moves to be had. I guess just do a dodge first, so that if I'd um, if I'd used my dodge skill, <laughs> God. but um, then I could have gone for the blitz. Oh, I didn't even declare a blitz. Did I declare a blitz? I didn't even declare a blitz. So declare a blitz and then do that. And if I'd used the dodge, but made the use the dodge skill, but made the dodge, I could have blocked him, couldn't I? So then a two wouldn't have been a turnover. One, two, three, four, five, six. There you go, lost. Lost and got two players killed instead of just instead of just conceding. I just literally can't win against Norse. It'd be a minus two dash block, so it definitely wasn't the best. He's got block. If he didn't have block it probably would have been, but he's got block, so So that's the thing, isn't it? That would have been a 61.4 with, with a reroll. 
Whereas mine was 66 with a reroll. More than that. 66.7 with a reroll, mine was. Yeah, lizards are at least good. At least somebody's... Like, lizards, it's it's completely different when you're playing against lizards. When you're against, playing against lizards, you're like, oh my god, this team is too fucking strong. How do I beat it? This is the exact opposite. It's, this team is so fucking shit, yet how do I beat it? Fucking hell. Like, at least, um... At least with, uh... You know, lizard men, you're like, holy shit, all of his guys are strength four. He's just basing me, and I can only half dice or get two diced. Not, I two dice him, do nothing, he one dice, kills my guy. Fucking hell. I should have just conceded. Save myself the stress of playing against fucking Norse of all teams. My god. I like that he randomly can't get that one that one close out. <sighs> one dice is shit, isn't it? But a four plus. Well I can't even can't even count over that. I'd have to four plus three plus double GFI out, so right, let's go. Maybe I should have stayed on the ground. Yeah, exactly. RS2000 deads. Absolutely. That's fucking Inarian secret, isn't it? <laughs> He's, they're actually just Norse with armor with, with agility 4. That's Inarian secret. Like, I mean, they are great when when they're armor nine. Obviously, they're fucking six three three nine for fifty uh, k is ridiculous, isn't it? Block six three three nine block for fifty k is just is just so ridiculously powerful. It's out of this world. So when that's what they are, they're a little bit overpowered. In fact, this game they've more been like six three three ten block for for fifty k. Pretty powerful. Yeah, the 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 red dice blitz would have probably been the right call. Had he um, had they not had block, I would have thought about it. I would have probably looked it up if if they didn't have block. But um, with having block, it definitely wasn't right to minus two. I knew I didn't have to look that up once they didn't have block.
Wow, Kizzleblip support as well. Crazy. Kizzleblip's pretty good for missions there. No, MVP for the dead guy. Got more armor breaks than him, eh? He made 53 bucks to my 30. How did that even happen? It's unbelievable. Unbelievable. There you go, Norse. Stay fantastic. 